Here's a block of wood set up in the vise, and we had to cut a hinge butt into it using just chisels and mallet. Initially, I get hold of the marking gauge and check from the outside edge of the hinge flap to the middle of the knuckle, which is the basically where the hinge bends. This is then transferred onto the timber to make sure that the hinge butt is just about the right level of overhang for the door to work properly. Here we are at the stage where we start recessing. Initially, I cut in down with the chisels and the mallets. Now here we are, gently removing the major part of the timber that we need to get out of the way by repeated cuts at a sort of diagonal level, leaving little chips of timber pointing upwards. The trick all the time is to be very careful and to involve gentle movements because it's all too easy hitting the chisel too hard to go down below the line, split out a bit of timber, or even worse, ruin the back edge of the recess. The marking gauge makes a little scribed indentation line which helps you align the chisel on the back edge of the recess and on each end it's really a case of using your vision as best you can to line up the chisel to make sure the cut is very accurate because you want a nice close fit that looks the best whilst the doors are not open all the time it's just when they are you'd like the hinge butts to look neatly cut in without any gaps. 